Welcome back, you guys. The 1113. If you are watching the clock this midday, tis the season for giving and helping to make the holidays brighter for others. That's where our WFAA Santa's Helpers Toy Drive comes in. It is in its 52nd year, you guys. 52 years, and it kicks off with the first drive through tonight over in Frisco. You can join us there tonight from 5 until 8. Just bring a new unwrapped toy. Our very own Pete Delkis will be there to say hello and to collect all those toys from you. Joining us now is Teresa Jackson, executive director and CEO of one of our Santa's helpers agencies, sharing life community outreach. Thank you so much for joining us, Teresa. Good morning to you. Good morning. It's a pleasure to be here. Look, we've been living in the pandemic now for almost two years. How have the needs in the community served been affected by the pandemic? Well, considerably, as you can imagine, um, many families who were living doing fine paycheck to paycheck a little savings tucked away have depleted those resources even some of those folks are ones that might have donated a toy to this driver or others in the years past and they're now needing some assistance overcoming all of the last almost two years of difficulties and changes the winter storm it's just been a tough couple of years and those resources that might have allowed them to purchase toys for their own children are just not there. So not only do we have the folks that we might typically serve, we have a new group of people who are needing some help this year just to get over the, the bump in the road and um, provide some extra joy for their kids this Christmas. You know, and that's certainly been evident in some of the, even the food drives that we've been seeing around here. Yeah. What services besides toys does Sharing Life provide in the community? Well, we love our Christmas toy fair every year. It's a joy to be a, a partner with Santa's helpers in that, but we have many programs that we provide to people in need throughout the year. And that includes a very, includes a very large food pantry. We're also a hub for the North Texas food bank. So we are a mini food bank, if you will, to 80 additional partners in Dallas Kaufman and Rockwall counties. We provide clothing and school supplies, books, um, basic household items. We have job training in entry level healthcare occupations, and those lead to national certifications that lead to living wage employment. We have rent and utility assistance, mortgage assistance. We've been very privileged to work with a number of different government funders for some of that CARES and ARPA money to be able to assist people in need who might otherwise have found themselves facing evictions. Um, we've also been able to work uh, with our team to provide financial coaching. And that's especially important right now as people are trying to live um, a little closer to their budget and, and stretch those dollars. So we're working with folks who need that help and wanna learn more about creating a spending plan and helping their credit uh, to, to get better or, or maintain a good credit score. And we have those coaching hours available both individually with folks as well as peer coaching available. That is One so other thing, necessary. My goodness, uh, you guys have so much that you offer all encompassing. OK, financial literacy, financial coaching, certainly something that everyone needs. And honestly, regardless of age at this point, what types of toys, something also very important are on the yes. kids list this year at Sharing Life? Well, as always, wheels are big. Uh, it doesn't matter what year it is or how much great technology comes out with toys. Kids still want things with wheels. So bikes, trikes, ride on toys for toddlers and preschoolers, wagons, scooters, those are big. And you know, it doesn't have to be expensive. A scooter, you can get a, a scooter for 20 bucks and that can be a really great gift and make a, ch a child very happy. Then there are the other things that are traditional that are they're, that are always in high demand, including Legos, boys and girls. Uh, that is a really important um, toy that helps build that brain capacity and, and creates lots of opportunities for families to do projects together. Another one is board games. Uh, again, no matter how much technology we get, nothing replaces the family interaction that happens when a family gathers around the table for a good old game of Monopoly or Sorry or, or Yahtzee or whatever the case may be. So any board games are also welcome. Teresa, where can folks find information about you? I know I'm just about out of time, but I got to let folks know how can okay. they find information about your organization? Sharing Life can be found on the web at sharing.life. 
that's it. HTTP, uh, you know, with all of that, or just www.sharing.life. That's that's our uh, website. And on all of the media, social media channels, Sharing Life, Sharing Life TX, and, and you can find us there. Teresa Jackson, Executive Director and CEO. Thank you so much uh, for sharing the amazing work about your organization here with us this morning. Thank you, it's a pleasure. Well, as a reminder, you guys, we've got 50,000 kids on our Santa's Helpers list this year, and you can donate a toy tonight at our Santa's Helpers drive through event. It is up in Frisco from 5 to 8 p.m. at Frisco Fire Safety Town. If you cannot make it out there, you can make a donation online. Oh, I just love the Christmas tunes. You can make a donation online at WFAA.com slash Santa's Helpers, or just point your phone's camera at that QR code there on your screen. It'll take you straight to our Samsung Helpers Amazon wish list. Whatever you buy will be delivered directly to Samsung Helpers. Also, just four days and counting left to enter our Samsung Helpers gift box sweepstakes from Cowboys tickets to a night at the Statler Hotel to VIP tickets to Jurassic World the experience. We've got all kinds of goodies up for grabs. Once you make a donation online, look for the link to the Sansa's Helper sweepstakes to check out the prizes and enter the last day to enter is Monday. Greg, we see the